Hello YouTube and welcome to the classic series. In this video, I'll be showing you how to change your Windows 7 logon. There's two applications that can do this for you, Tweaks Logon and the Thuse J Windows 7 Logon Editor. So these both come in zip files and what you'll need to do is extract them. You do not need to install Tweaks Logon, however you do need to install the Thuse J Windows 7 Logon Editor. They are two different applications and a link to download both of them will be in the video description. So Let's start with Tweaks Logon, and you simply go into the folder and run the application. Oops, let me run it again. So, this is what I've got at the moment. I'm just going to revert to default Logon screen. Okay, what you need to do is go to Change Logon Screen, and then select any image on your computer. So Let's go to C, Windows, Web, Wallpaper. This is also where you can find the default Windows 7 images or wallpapers. I'll select this one here. And then it says the selected image file size is too large. Only images less than 245 kilobytes are compatible. You want me to create a copy and automatically adjust the image. Select Yes. And it says new logon background successfully installed. Click OK. And now you can test it. And this will simply lock your computer. As you can see, I have the new background. So I'm going to log on again. And I'm going to revert to default login screen. And now let's test out the Thuse J Windows 7 Logon Editor. You'll need to install this again. So install the this one here. And then run the application. And what you want to do is go to Browse. And select an image on your computer. It has to be less than 240, 250 kilobytes. This J Windows 7 Logon Editor cannot compress it. So it actually has a few images with the install. So when you install it, it does come with a few images. So I'm just going to go to Vista and select Data 1 and changes it there. You can also download a few backgrounds by going to More Backgrounds and that will simply link you off to the website and you can download a few images from there. And then you can go to Change Background and it says Successfully Change Your Windows Logon. Click OK and it says You need to restart your PC. Um, just like No. If you're doing any work anyway, and I'm going to close the logon editor, and now I can simply test it by locking the computer. And as you can see, I have the new background. So that's pretty much it how to change your Windows 7 logon. A link to download both the applications will be in the video description. And uh, thanks for watching. Please comment, rate, and subscribe if you like my videos. And thanks again.